Hello everyone, this is Allie from Kidzu. Today is the last day of the Great Backyard Bird Count. I hope you've had a chance to participate and if you'd like some more information, you can watch a video we made about the count. It's on our YouTube channel or on our Facebook page. We've been talking all about birds this weekend. We learned how to make a birdhouse out of string. We read a book about the Audubon Christmas Bird Count and we learned how to help birds in the winter time. Now this morning, I did my last count and I saw a lot of birds. What I saw was uh, one morning dove, one blue jay, four Carolina chickadees, one brown thrasher, one American goldfinch, two dark-eyed juncos, six white-throated sparrows, four song sparrows, and nine northern cardinals. And over the entire weekend, I saw 96 birds coming from 15 different species. Now all this information is called data, and now that I've entered it into the count, scientists can use this data to learn about birds that live in my area. Today I'm going to show you how you can continue the fun at home with our Brilliant Birds Discovery Kit. You can find more information about this on our website. It is a take-home kit that you can purchase and have all to yourself. And we're going to have a look inside now. So what the most important item in here is our Brilliant Birds Discovery Booklet. This booklet was written by Kidzu and it is full of information about birds and it has activities that you can do. It has links that you can scan if you want to watch some videos about birds or look at other activities all about birds. It also comes with a discovery journal where you can write down your data or any other information about birds uh, in there and it comes with a North Carolina bird guide so you can become an expert on identifying birds in your own neighborhood. It comes with some bird feathers and a pair of birds and an Audubon bird call, so it makes a little sound just like a bird. It also comes with some bird seed, and this is for an activity where you can make some suet, which is a good kind of food to feed birds in the winter time. And then you can add on a couple of extras. You can add on these beautiful bird wings for some dress up play, and then you can also add on this wonderful storybook called Ruby's Birds. Thanks for joining us today. I hope you did have a chance to participate in the Great Backyard Bird Count. And remember, this is an annual event, so you can actually participate again next year in February. Bye.